Hi everyone, how are you doing? <laughs> My, is, is it a test? What do you mean? Is it a test? <laughs> are you testing the audio? Or, no. No, no, Never it's for real. No. Yes, we already started. <laughs> it's in English, so. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't expecting. <laughs> Yes, it's in the English. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> I guess most of you guys know her. She's my cousin. Yes, Maggie Blanda. Mm -hmm. Okay. She can speak Spanish. Spanish. <laughs> She can speak Italian <laughs> fluently. <laughs> All right. I um, try to. <laughs> um, ah, tell a little bit about you and how uh, you've learned Italian. Uh, well, I, I decided to go to move to Italy because I wanted to have my citizenship, uh, Italian citizenship. And then, yes, because I am European. <laughs> And then uh, I moved uh, to Italy in 2000, 2005. Ah, uh, yes, uh, uh, really? Yeah, You're no, gonna no. ask me the memory game. <laughs> 2005. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then um, I, I have never spoke or learned Italian before. Uh, kind of a ball. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> Zombies are coming. And then uh, all Italian, I, I learned it in Italy. All right. So when you moved there, uh -huh. you didn't know uh, much or you, you, can, you, you can say you didn't know anything. No, anything. And it's so different. I thought I, I knew something. Mm -hmm. I was studying by myself at home. Uh, and I, I thought I could uh, speak a little bit. For example, say hello, I don't know, or ask for help or ask for water. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> the, those survivor, survive right. things. Then you started using the, the help words. Mantovani, <laughs> Giovanni, Bianchini. Yeah. Yes, and the verbs as well. I, I tried to uh, learn uh, the con conjugations. How can I say in English? Uh, Cognates? The, uh, the I am, you are. Uh, how can I say? Pronouns? No, conjugation, the, the verbs. The tenses. The verb, verb tenses. tenses. All right. In Italian. Okay. I, I tried to memorize some of them. Uh, to I think it's easier to speak when you know the verbs because mm -hmm. all the phrases we have verbs. Right. But it was uh, completely different because my uh, my ear I couldn't hear exactly uh, what they say. Mm -hmm. I mean the pronunciation, those things. All right. Um, so uh, I, I I just. Uh, didn't know how to speak Italian. So you had really to start from scratch. Yes. Is it uh, different from Portuguese? Is it similar to Portuguese? You would say um, ah, yes. a little bit in the middle? It's similar because it's Latin. Uh, Latin, uh, Latin. Yeah. Latin, yeah. Latin, yeah. Language. Latin language. Uh -huh. And then um, we have a um, lot of things similar. As the verb tenses, mm. yes, lovely, <laughs> <laughs> and some words as well. But the pronunciation is, is different, and they speak mm -hmm. so much faster than than us. We speak, uh, yes, in ah, Portuguese. You, you mean Italian and Portuguese? Like the Portuguese is a little bit slower than Italian. Yes. Oh, really? Yeah, I think so. Okay, very interesting. No, we were supposed to think mm -hmm. because actually you can speak Italian, so. Mm -hmm. All right, interesting. So that's the, the difference uh, from hearing someone speaking in Italian, mm -hmm. Italian speaking in Italian. Okay, yeah, all right. <laughs> And then you have to um, start to, um, 
uh, get getting familiar. Getting to know the language. Yes, get no, but something uh, so, the getting familiar. You can use familiar mm -hmm. like getting used to it. Getting used no, right? to <laughs> hear and then to speak. Okay. Because to speak, we are we are always. Uh, um, I, I, I speak by myself. Mm -hmm. I, I feel shy sometimes because I, I don't want to commit errors, uh, mistakes, and then um, it's difficult to is express yourself because you don't know all the vocabulary. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, mm, so just a second. It was very very important as part of your learning exhibition listening to yes it was very important because mm -hmm. you would read mm -hmm. the word but you didn't know how to pronounce yes exactly i understand so listening oh. was very important yes and i started uh, now i'm rem remembering mm -hmm. uh, i love the uh, uh, singer called uh, georgia have I ever told about Georgia? No. I guess so. It's an Italian singer. You yes. used to listen to her. Right? Yes, and I loved her songs. I started listening uh, to her songs and uh, at the same time reading the songs. Okay. Reading and listening. Mm -hmm. uh, um, I read some books. Um, Paulo Coelho books. Oh. <laughs> yes. mm. In Italian. <laughs> because at that time, I, I I used to like <laughs> Paul Coelho. Yeah, okay. Is it right? Uh, if I say I used to like Paul yeah. Coelho. Don't you like him anymore? No. So, yes. So, <laughs> I used to. Used to. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Why don't you like him anymore? I don't know. Uh, I, I like other things, maybe. And okay. I, I, I don't enjoy more this kind of reading. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's that. Okay. Okay. Um, ah, um, I know you want to hear her speaking Italian, <laughs> right? So, no, can you introduce <laughs> to... A YouTuber, YouTuber. <laughs> Don't <Yeah>. forget <laughs> to click the like <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Don't like. Don't like. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, can you introduce it? Do you still remember? Do you still remember? Italian, Italian. <laughs> because it's another thing after yeah. you uh -huh. introduce yourself. I'm gonna ask you about. Uh -huh. So, introduce yourself in Italian, please. Look at uh, the camera. <laughs> uh, salve, mi chiamo Maria Eduarda. Io vivo a Sorocaba da, da quando sono tornata in, eh, in Brasile da otto anni circa. Mm, ho vissuto in Italia per, uh, per cinque anni per fare la cittadinanza e adesso è da, da un po' che non parlo italiano, poi c'è... Mi sono scordata un paio di cose. Oh, I'm so shy. <laughs> so cute. No, oh, serio. Lovely. Oh, really? Really? Ma che fofa. It's a long time I don't speak Italian, so uh, mm -hmm. it's uh, kind of weird. Yeah, that, that's why, that's what I was, uh, I want to approach. But, okay, recapping. Listening was very important. In yes. your opinion, because you read it, you mm -hmm. studied grammar, the things, blah, blah, blah. Yet, I, I, I mm -hmm. was so shy mm -hmm. to, to meet people. I, I tried to uh, affront. To confront. Confront. Okay, but confront. confront is like facing, like face your fear. Yes. That's, that's yes. it. Okay. Face my fear. Oh, uh, uh, you uh, try to. Confront. Overcome to face yes. that okay that fear All to right. talking people and then sometimes I I just uh, get out uh, by myself alone trying to ask uh, what kind of bus uh, can can take me I don't know some place in the city and and trying to speak in, in Italian guys <laughs> wonderful tip so she decided going out by herself, she knew the buses, etc., mm -hmm. but just to 
practice just to uh, talk to somebody else and see if they could understand her mm -hmm. and if you could understand the people, right? Mm -hmm. Excellent. Thank you. And I always try this uh, this kind of thing. Also, when I, I went to France, I speak just a little bit of France. Mm -hmm. uh, French. <laughs> and um, I tried to communicate using the French language, not English. Uh, and they are, are so glad and, and they try to understand you because uh, you are trying to talk in their language. So they are, uh, mm -hmm. are happy, not happy, they are, they are proud. Okay, they are glad. They glad. are... They are mm -hmm. Thankful, they uh, yes, they, they are thankful. All right, mm -hmm. very good. Uh, so, listening is very important. Practicing, mm -hmm. speaking is very important. Uh, and don't be shy, right? Yes, it's difficult because it depends on the person. But uh, we have to we have to confront or face your your fears because you see. Uh, when you went to France, your your Italian mm -hmm. was fluent. Yes. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So you could speak very well. Italian in France. Italian, but Italian. Uh, your speak French. Italian in France. No, no. I mean, oh. when you went to France, mm -hmm. you you had already got a excellent level mm -hmm. in Italian. Okay. Yet you tried to speak in French, but mm -hmm. French you were. You are like basic. Yes. And I'm they too basic. <laughs> <laughs> um, and they try to understand you. They didn't make fun fun of no, you. No, they, they, So they, it was the opposite. Uh -huh. They were very very glad. Yeah. Even if with the basic French, mm -hmm. they said, "Wow, she's trying yeah, to communicate." Yeah. Okay. They were thankful, as I, mm -hmm. I said before. Mm -hmm. So you see, don't don't be shy. Mm -hmm. Don't think they will make fun of you. They will not try to understand you because it's going to be the opposite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes. Yes. All mm -hmm. right. Anything else you'd like to to tell them? Mm -hmm. You mean uh, when they are in a, in a Another country. another country, yes, could be. Uh -huh. Or while we're studying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think uh, I, I like to watch the movies in the original sound and then try. Uh, I, I, I like to read as well the, um, the, the subtitles. subtitles in English. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, then I can read the words and hear the sound. English is very, uh, the pronunciation is very weird. It's kind of Viking language. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> you know? yeah. yeah. <laughs> because uh, the, the words, uh, they, they change so much, the pronunciation. You mean what you read is yes. totally different from what you mm -hmm. are going to, to hear. hear? Yes. Yeah, I totally agree with mm -hmm. you. Okay. All right. So, um, thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you for asking me to your channel. <laughs> now you are so famous. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank bye you. Bye. See you. See you in class. Mm -hmm. Mwah. <laughs>